welcome back. This is Lisa from Diamonds and Stitches, and I am back to do an unboxing today. I'm so excited. I actually received this earlier in the week. It's Diamond Art Club unboxing of the three new, three of the many new releases that they did in May, May 7th. And, um, and so I'm excited. So let's get this started. So you know that they always put in a packing slip in here, and then if you pay attention to your packing slip, it, I hope you're not seeing my address, my gosh, no you can't, ha, it's just a packing slip. <laughs> um, they have a 15% off code on the packing slip, so uh, if you're paying attention to your packing slip, and that is all that's in the box. All right, so I received three. I, I decided to, um, by three. They are all Mandy Manzano's and I am so excited to get them. So the first one I got was Undersea Dreaming. Um, Ariel. It's Ariel. Um, or to me it's Ariel. I, I also got Hello Beastie and there's a bit of a story to Hello Beastie. And then I also got uh, The Snow Queen, which um, is Elsa and my granddaughter is going to be very excited about as am I. So let's do the first one. It is Elsa. Let's see what she looks like. So Diamond Art Club, when they, um, when they package their, their, uh, boxes, you always get it in a nice, uh, box that has their packing tape that has their logo on it, etc. And, um, so nice, uh, you know, right away where it's from, which is awesome. So when you receive your boxes, uh, not only in the packing box, but also it comes in these nice, really sturdy boxes. And so, you know, the squish, the squish rate is probably a lot lower, which is awesome. Um, this one that we're going to do is Snow Queen. It is round diamonds with A, B and the size is 42 by 97. I want to say that this is going to be the largest one I'm doing. Uh, I think, I think. So let's open this bad girl up and see what she looks like. So in every Diamond Art Club box, you receive three things. You receive the Diamond Painting Toolkit. Inside that toolkit, there is the magic, they call it the magic applicator. It is a pen, the diamond painting pen. Uh, and this one is blue and it, and it will come with a three placer or spacer. I think it's called a three placer on, um, on here. Uh, you receive some, you receive, oops, there's the placer right there. And it dropped my pen. Okay, so the placer will go on here like that. Can you see that? The placer. And then they have a nice little grippy. This one is blue. I've seen pink ones. I've seen purple ones. I've even had a green one. So that's pretty cool. And that goes on there for your comfort in, in uh, holding your pen. Um, they come with a clear tray to put your gems in or your diamonds. And then they also come with a funnel, which is nice for when you are placing your, your diamonds um, back into uh, their containers or in these awesome little bags that they provide. Let's see here. They have little baggies. And so it's really nice to, you know, open it up and then pour your diamonds back into the baggie if you need that. Um, I have a storage container uh, system that I use, which I kind of viewed in my last uh, diamond painting video, in a previous diamond painting video. I love this new system. I have tried several, and one day I'm going to put together a video on all of the different storage um, ideas that I started out with and what is now working for me. So those, oh, and, and the best part, this is the best part, I love this part. It makes me so happy. It just makes me so happy. The wax that you need um, to put your pen into, and that's what you use uh, that holds the diamond 
onto your pen and then um, and then you transfer it onto the canvas. And these ones are in the shape of a heart and I love that. It makes me happy when I see this. And um, for those of you with kids, if you put the emoji, haha, <laughs> they're the heart eyes for the emoji. Sorry, I know. I have a granddaughter, she's eight. She just turned eight yesterday. And so I'm a little more kidified maybe than I should be. <laughs> um, you also, inside the kit also will be the gems little little glare the gems and what I love about diamond painting diamond art club is that they will put the name of the kit on here so this one says snow queen the snow queen and then I think that they even put the date that it was I think that this is the date that it was packaged and um, so this one says it's 2019 03 so March 31st and then um, they're all nicely oh I'm so sorry that's off the noise they're all nicely kitted up in here. And let's see if we can find it a glimpse which ones are the AB diamonds real quick. Do you know that I can't see them real quick? Well, that's too funny. Um, I don't know, we'll come back to it. They're super, you sh you'd think that I should see it right away. They're super sparkly. And I'm having a blind moment, you guys. Um, Huh. Okay, I don't notice which ones they are. Sorry. Blind. Sometimes a little blind. Um, and then the canvas, the piece de resistance, comes in a nice little package. Now, I uh, take mine out and typically I don't roll them back up and put them back in their packaging. But if you do it tight enough, you can to store it. Um, but it's really nice because it's the packaging uh, from Diamond Art Club is superb. It is just superior to everyone else that I've seen, and um, and I, I love it. The canvases are velvety on the back, um, and so lovely to touch. Like I could touch it all day long. It's not plasticky feeling. It's not you know icky, um, and so that's kind of nice. All of the, oh, the colors, oh, you guys, oh my gosh, oh, the sparkles, oh, <laughs> I'm so excited about this. Um, I haven't seen one yet. I suspect that Diamond Art Club, um, they, they put a clear coating, a clear cover on the diamond um, uh, picture to uh, protect the, the glue. And um, some of them you'll find like white, white wrapping, some of them you'll find, um, some people like to put, uh, what is it, parchment paper on theirs. Now when you unroll the kit, oh look at how large this is, this is big, this is big, this is my whole entire coffee table, big. Um, everyone comes with a how to diamond art paint if you are new, uh, it will show you how to actually use your diamond kit, and so that's kind of nice. Um, so let's let's roll this the other way so that we can have it lay flat. This is just a trick I picked up um, with Diamond Art Club's canvases. I bet that if you just lay it out on the table for just a little bit of time, it will flatten itself out. But uh, in order for for me to speed up the process, this is what I do. Okay, are we ready to see what she looks like? Oh. Okay, she's beautiful. Oh, she's beautiful. Can you guys see her? Oh, she is beautiful. Look at her face. Mandy, I have to tell you that your art is spectacular and, oops, too heavy up there, sorry. I only have part of the corner. Um, your art is just spectacular. Look at how gorgeous. Oh my goodness, okay. I can't tell you how excited I am to, oh, okay. The other thing that I like about Diamond Art Club is that they put the color list on both sides of the canvas. So this one is up here in the top left. And so you can see this one has 35 colors and then they put it in the lower right. 
And this is spectacular, especially if you are diamond painting along and you put it on a draft table and you roll it all up and everything. And then, you know, you, so you can see um, the, you can see the colors that you're, you're beading. And, um, and that's nice. And so then when you're finished the top part and you let it hang um, over your drafting table or your lap, 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 lap desk, or table or whatever you're working on, um, you are then, you know, you can't see that top anymore, right? And so then you have the color key um, or list or whatever you want to call it. Color, color key to me makes sense. Um, so, okay, she's spectacular. I, I just, wow, I am so looking forward to doing this one. Thank you, Mandy, for your beautiful art. Um, I just stunning okay the second one I'm going to do is hello beastie I am excited for this one hello beastie she is um, she's spectacular uh, round with a B again and 47 by 63 is the size on this one um, I it's my mission in life to find all of the um, to find all of the evil, villainous uh, characters from from Disney, uh, I love them. I relate to them. This one uh, is Maleficent from Sleeping Beauty. Happens to be my favorite movie of all time. Um, I don't know why, but I love Maleficent. I she's spectacular in her evilness and the way she plotted. I, I love her. I love her. And so I relate to her. Again, same kind of kit, uh, tool kit. I'm not going to go through it for every kit that I do because it is the same. And um, they're all beautiful. Now this one, let's see if I can figure out the AD Diamonds right away. Oh my gosh, I can't believe how blind I am. Oh, you guys, come on. Seriously. Okay, the colors in here are just really beautiful. <laughs> oh, you guys, this is, oh, there they are, they're green. Okay, these ones are green. Oh, how pretty are these? Okay, so see, let's see if you can see the difference, right? Okay, so see these green ones here have more of like an iridescent-y color, and then these ones, still very sparkly, but they are not as as um, glittery, I guess is what I would, would call it. Um, so how exciting is that? I wonder if there's any others. Um, so pretty. I'm super excited about, about the colors in this one. Now, this one, Diamond Art Club did a posting on this one and said that they were offering this one at a lower cost because uh, they did not feel that the face, the features in the face were... Um, what they wanted to uh, see in the canvas. And so they offered this one at a much reduced rate for the size of the painting, which yay, Art Dar yay Diamond Art Club for, um, you know, your standards are just excellent. And um, I, saw the picture online and said, you know what, to me, it wasn't really about the face anyways. Um, it's about the vibe of the art and, um, and the meaning to me for it. So really the face wasn't as big of an issue maybe as it could be to somebody else. So um, to me, I believe that this kit was $29.90 Five ninety eight ninety nine something like that thirty dollars, and um, I was ecstatic, and so I couldn't wait to get online and get it. And <laughs> oh, I money were well spent. I mean. I guess I can see what they're talking about in the face. Um, and then 
DC. There she is down there. It's Sleeping Beauty down there, or the little girl down there. Um, I, you know what, other than her lips maybe being a little bit mm, bigger than maybe you would expect, more prominent, I guess, that's okay. I have big lips too, so <laughs> Maleficent, we, and, we could be sisters, I don't care. Um, but oh my goodness, the colors are spectacular. Now this one has 42 colors. Elsa had 35 and she's bigger. This baby has 30 and 42, 42 colors. I am excited to do this. I, I, I might do this. I think I said that in my last one, how excited I was to do Nefertiti. I want to do that one. I have so many I want to do. Yes. Um, let's see now, did this one come with? No. So, um, in prior, um, kits, Diamond Art Club was, um, giving a small little color index, um, sheet with, um, with the kits that were released. And it doesn't look, none of these, so far, none of these have had that in there. Okay. And the last one that I'm going to unkit or unbox today is uh, Undersea Dreaming. Um, also a huge Ariel fan. So um, I would love an Ursula. Hint, 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 hint. Ursula, hint. <laughs> um, this one also is round with AB and it's a 47 by 4, 78. So it's also going to be a nice big one. Um, oh my gosh, I'm so excited. I, I like all things um, undersea. I am a big, I, I wanted to be an oceanographer at one point in my life. Um, I wasn't prepared to go to school for so long to do so though, unfortunately. And, um, but I love, uh, sea life. I love, uh, our oceans and, um, the ecosystem in the, in the ocean. I, um, I love it all. So, and I prefer to believe that mermaids are real. Um, yeah. So when this one was released, it, it was a no brainer, had to get it. Um, so now let's have a look and see if I can figure out which AB Diamonds is in this one. Let's see now. It's like Christmas, you guys, sometimes. Like you see the you see the goodness and the goodies right away, and you're like, whoa, that's it. Okay, so these ones are the sparkly. Can you see that? They're more sparkly, they're white ones. So um, I am excited to see where that would be in the, in the kit. All right, let's undo this one. Diamond Art Club, like I love you. <laughs> I love you. Okay, let's get that out. Let's unroll it so you guys can see her in her full glory. Um, if I didn't explain this, this is the reason why I unroll this or roll it to the other, the other way, the opposite way, um, so that it lays flat quicker. And, um, there's something magical about these canvases that that's what they do. So, uh, I think that it's pretty awesome. All right. You guys ready? Oh my gosh oh my gosh oh my gosh she is beyond gorgeous oh, here let's do it from the top sorry guys she's beyond gorgeous look at her look at her tail look at her tail and her face and her her beautiful red hair and the bubbles Oh, okay. I'm in love. I'm just in love. <laughs> I, can I just tell you how happy I am? I have so many diamond art kits stashed under my bed. Shh, nobody needs to know. And um, 
every single one of them that I undo, I want, I want to start. I want to start. I want to do them right now. And I, there's just not enough hours in the day. And, um, but, oh dear. Hello, beastie. Undersea dreaming. Elsa. I don't know. I've got Nefertiti. I have, oh my gosh, I have so many and I want to get them all. I, I want to do them all. I want to do them all. <sighs> Can I clone myself? I'm wondering if that's an option. If I could clone myself and then do all the diamond paintings and then come back into one person so that I can enjoy them all. That seems real, right? Okay, guys, um, that is all for today. I will see you in my next diamond painting video. Hopefully I will have one with tips and tricks and then uh, potentially um, maybe a start on one of these three or maybe the previous ones and I don't know. Anyways, enjoy your weekend. For those of you who are moms, happy Mother's Day and I uh, hope that you enjoy your weekend, whether it's with children, fur babies, uh, family members, aunts, doesn't matter. Well, whoever you are, grandmas, grand um, enjoy your weekend, celebrate you. All right, I will see you in my next video. Bye-bye.